Chris. <laughs> A-Hole Productions. Hey, fuck face. <laughs> Seek as a soldier. Uh, I am against this alien. All right, so how do we get... Where do we got to go now? Uh, find a way to the Solomon's habitation tower. Shit. I gotta pause. Barry's just killing with kindness. we gotta go? Nope, I'm in the wrong fucking area. <laughs> Stay the fuck away from me! <laughs> oh my goodness. That thing got smart, though. It didn't charge me. So you guys are right. It adapts. Uh, I had to fucking walk up to it to burn it. Holy shit. That was intense. But I can't play it. Shit. Okay, we made it. I definitely want to seek to sneeze loudly and scare the shit out of himself as a result. Man, a guy can dream, right? I didn't sneeze the other night, but I think I can't remember what I did the last time we played this. But I did something where I startled myself. And then I think a little bit of poop came out of my... Actually, not a little bit. You know me. I, I shit like a monster. So I think I just full-on changed pants uh, after it.
shit, guys. Hey, fuckface! Over here! Come get some, bitch! Yeah, you like that shit? Shit. Get the fuck out of here. Um, Crobo Cop, ready for some action. Oh, this is the opposite of action. This is me shitting my pants. Shit! <laughs> oh, fuck! <laughs> oh, shit! I forgot. I forgot I fucking saved. Um, I forgot I saved right when that alien dropped down from the chute and it looked like it kept it in there. That is freaking awesome. Holy shit. Whoa, guys. Thank you. Dang. Holy shit. Hey, okay, cunning space fly. Uh, and Joe, man, thank you all. So guys, we are already at $30 for Angel. Holy shit. You guys are awesome. You guys are freaking awesome. Thank you so much. And by the way, Cole Nation, 177th follower from Cole Nation. Shout out to Cole. Thank you so much for being here. Oh, you just jumped in. Hey, what's up, Cole? How's it going? Um, Cole and Sarah, thank you so much for being my 175th and 176th or 176, 177th follower. That is super nice of you guys. Nice work, Professor Johnson, whether it's in the third, $30. So I'm gonna add, I'm gonna add another 10 bucks to that. Probably 15. I'm probably gonna, I can squeeze 15, I think, off my, my next check. It's not gonna be a big check, but I can squeeze 15 off of it. So that will bring us to $45, um, which is super awesome. So we are already $15 away from getting Angel Resident Evil 7. And I will, like I said, I will put you guys, I will list you all as brain donors for this month. All right, gotta fucking pause. Joe's probably gonna dress up as a Nintendo Switch with neon colored Joy Con, Seraph added. Not those boring gray ones. <laughs> really is. All right, where are we going? No fucking idea. So let's save. I got to save this time, guys. I'm sorry. Because this is a whole new area, but I, I'll, maybe I'll skip the next two saves or something for you guys. So we can especially start playing seven on Matt. No, fuck that. Well, I didn't get the special edition, actually, Barry. Um, I just got the main version of the game, the $60 base version. So I, I won't be able to play Mad. I have to unlock it first. No, no, Big Step is you doing that 24-hour stream of Just Dance. Like I said, we getting you that beach body. <laughs> I can't play for 24 hours, but... Are you close enough for radio contact? I'm here! Thank God, I hear you. I need you to extend the dog cradle plan quickly. 
Um, this is what it feels like when doves cry. <laughs> Initiate the docking procedure. Okay. Oh, good. They're raiding this room with me. You've just been hacked, son. course in the middle of the fucking room. Stand by. Oh, fuck. Get to the airlock. All right, where's that at? Bro, I just screamed. That was awesome. Bro, I just screamed in my basement. <laughs> no. No fucking way. Whoa, oh, shit. One of, those, one of those things is open. Do we have a fucking alien in us? Come on, bro. Hear that? Oh fuck. Oh shit. Oh. oh shit. Oh shit. That one almost fucking got me. They're, they're traveling in twos now.
R.I.P. R.I.P. We're not fucking dying today. The man. Yeah, some of three I like, but I can understand why there's a lot of hatred for it. All right. Okay. So this, you know, this is when we're fucked. It was when they start giving you ammo, like freely, and when I can talk and no one's coming after me. Here we go. I, I hate it as a kid, actually. I was like, where's Michael Myers? Yeah, see, a pun on don't rewatch, it holds up. I'm sure it might to some extent. I didn't care about the Michael Myers thing. I wasn't that attached to Michael. Jason was always my favorite because Jason was kind of like a zombie. And I, I grew up a zombie kid. I grew up like a George Romero right outside of Pittsburgh, Monroeville, like went to the mall, went to the cemetery. Uh, so I kind of grew up around, around George Romero. So Jason always felt like a zombie to me. So I kind of liked Jason. Um, so Michael Myers never, he was creepy, but he didn't really, I didn't care that he wasn't in the third movie. I just, I don't know. I just, as a kid, I didn't just follow the movie. I thought it was, maybe it was a movie made more for adults. I mean, obviously as a kid, you shouldn't be watching it. It's rated R, but I didn't really, um, I didn't really get into it that much. Which Friday 13 movies are good. There are so many Friday 13 movies. Uh, didn't know where to start. Uh, I would just start with the original. Uh, I will say most of them probably don't hold up, but, uh. Just don't watch Jason Goes to Hell and unless you've seen some episodes. Don't start there, I would say. Don't start with Jason Goes to Hell and don't, um... Wait, what? Go up, lady. Oh, shit, I can't. Um, none of them are objectively good. Yeah, I wouldn't say any of them are good. Um, but just don't start with Jason Goes to Hell. And maybe don't start with Jason X either. <laughs> Damn, this girl. Like Roger Ebert never gave any of them. Oh, shit. Fuck. Oh, shit. Get out of here. Yeah, so... That's kind of my situation. So, yeah, I, and I and I don't I don't have an engineering degree. I wish I was that smart, dude. I'm like a jan I'm like janitor level. Like I like creating things and I have a lot of creativity, but I don't think I have a lot of talent with it and sometimes it takes me time to do things and I don't think anyone is just going to, you know, like I'm I'm never going to probably go above where I'm at right now. So I work a lot of menial jobs. Like I work at Lego at, you know, in in sales right now, and it's fun. I love Lego. I actually think I have one of the coolest jobs ever, even though it's pretty basic and most people that go there just go there for a paycheck. I think it's one of the coolest things I I've ever worked on um is working at Lego. So I'm definitely not complaining about my life. It's just sometimes hard for me to get a job um with a lot of the stuff I have going on in the background. Whoa. Sh shit's just floating in the air. From two and beyond, they tend to get more and more campy. Yes, forty thousand. Yeah, forty thousand. Oh, about. It's like thirty-eight, around thirty-eight, thirty-nine thousand per per coiling procedure. Yeah, it's fucking crazy. I hope you're. I hope you're okay. You're my new favorite person now. Oh, dude, that's very nice of you. I, I'm fine. I I, I I try really hard not to. Um, I don't. I don't ever want to bring down the stream. So I do my best. I do my best to try to just be cheerful and and. Sometimes I, I call it play healthy where I, I, you know, I act like I'm doing okay, but I legit am doing fine right now. My head hurts a little, but it's not. Nothing this soda can't handle. Oh, good. No, uh, no drippy drippy. Uh, there's no hope whoever you voted for. <laughs> yeah, no, there really wasn't. Oh, is zombie month? And no, what's up, Tony? No, we played a zombie game earlier. We played Resident Evil Revelations 2. So uh, now we're, um, now we're trying to finish Alien Isolation. So welcome everybody. Shout out to Tony. Uh, Freddie was doing karate and wearing power gloves. Yeah, that Freddie lost me after like the second one. Although I love Robert England, Robert England's dope. Uh, I agree. See, Lego even at the bottom is great. Oh, what's up? There you go, Balazar. Balazar, I was talking about you earlier about that list. Do you happen to have that list on you still of all the games that were? Um... Oh, look at this view of all the games that are banned from Twitch. I was trying to remember some of them. We were all laughing. 
Uh, everyone, shout out to Balazar, also uh, a Lego uh, employee and awesome person. Spacesuit, go to bed. No, we're so close to the end. We can't, we can't stop this. I can't do another stream of this game. It's too intense. Um, coming near the end, I'm working on an experimental brain coiling procedure where you just swaddle the brain in yarny yarn. Aw, dude. That's awesome. <laughs> uh, welcome. I still got to finish that. Welcome to Yarnia and the lose the suspicion. Lose the suspicion design. I got to work on those. Wow. Look at look how hard it is to just move right now. Damn. This is so wicked. Look at the environment. Like I kind of wish the camera wasn't blurry. Um. Oh man, this is awesome. You bet, man. Ah, oh, thanks, Balazar. Lego hype! So yeah, at the end of the stream, I'll, I'll talk about our giveaway we're going to do on the on the 23rd, the Resident Evil 7 giveaway, and I'll show you guys my Lego set for my new show called Gotham City Bricks. Oh! Uh, which, it'll start as soon as I can. I'm just putting a lot of work. I, I don't write a lot of comedy. I've written, like, novels and comic books before. I haven't really dabbled in comedy that much. Comedy's very hard to write. But, uh... I was actually cracking myself up some of the jokes I was coming up with. Um, and then I and then once it, I watched it until it wasn't funny anymore, and then I went back in and punched up the audio and punched up the jokes to make it funny again. So um, I'm just putting a lot into the first episode because you only get one chance at a first impression. So I want the first episode to be really, really good. And then once I get a formula down, I know the other ones will be good too. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Key card required. Well, I'm certainly not going to find a key card out here. Uh, you're too kind, Van Jones. <laughs> uh, Twitch. Ah, oh, there you go. Thank you. There's the list. Oh, we do have a. Key. Oh, we took the key card just now. Awesome. I guess I am going to find a key card out here. Thanks, game. Oh, we gotta go around the long way? Eat a dick. Whoa. Look at this. Wow. That's the station we were on, huh? Damn. That's so awesome. Uh, Postal's probably banned on Twitch. Yeah, I think so. Seek is about to shit himself again. Oh, dude. About. D dude, I... When we started, we got attacked one second into this game. I've been sitting in feces for fucking an hour and a half, whatever my uptime is. Oh shit. Uh, yeah. Shit. Let's keep an eye on this alien. Shit, when we can't see. It's gonna be right fucking there. Uh, L -L Seek doesn't see the alien. I, I saw it. I finally saw it. I'm I'm late. Hey, kitty money, have a good night. Uptime. Holy shit. Oh, three hours. That's because uh because we played another game first. So, gotcha. I'm wasted. The bear said <laughs> I just read my last comment, it made no sense. <laughs> That's okay, dude. Gonna have resting uh face all day tomorrow. Oh man. Get some sleep. Get some sleep. And uh, Kitty, if we're if we're still playing uh, Left 4 Dead 2 tomorrow, definitely jump in. We'll save us. We'll save a spot for you. Uh, which character do you want us to keep open for you, Kitty, on Left 4 Dead? Uh, have you heard about the thing from Outlast 2? They're done a Kickstarter for a diaper because the developer said you will shit yourself. Holy shit, no! But you know what? On my YouTube page, so I never played Outlast 1, but I do own it and Whistleblower because it was on sale during uh, Halloween or Black Friday, I think. It was like for five bucks or something for both games. Um, so I, I got... I, I, so what made me get it was I played the Outlast 2 demo and I recorded it. And I think Angel or Kitty or Marsha Cat, someone was in my stream that night when I did it. And they watched me literally freak the fuck out. Whoa. Good thing I hooked myself in. Oh, shit. Shit. Oh 
shit. There's, hey, what's up? Dang, I didn't even realize there's almost 30 people in this chat. All of you that are here, thank you so much. I think we're just about to beat Alien Isolation. This is my first time playing in, holy shit, this game's intense. No, fuck, oh, we're dead, aren't we? We're so dead. I was streaming, I streamed so loud that I woke my neighbors. They thought I was dying or something. <laughs> yeah, fuck indeed, holy shit. I usually play with my headset on so that all they hear is my voice from time to time, but luckily they're pretty chill on weekends, especially. Um, I try not to freak out too much, but this game, holy shit, that was awesome. You see all those fucking aliens like standing? Oh my God, that was so cool. That was so cool. Van Jones, thank you for donating this game. Holy shit, this game is fucking awesome. And thank you all for being here tonight. Uh, like I said, after the game, we'll talk about the giveaways we're gonna do on this channel and uh, some of the upcoming stuff we're gonna be doing on here as well. Damn, get to the, oh, I'm a fucking live? My way up to the bridge. How the hell is that possible? Let's zoom out, the bridge is that way, okay. Wait, it says ghost. Meet Verlaine on the bridge. Okay. Can we just go around that way? Can we climb this? No, we can't. Box in the way. Okay. This game was bay for sure. Ah, absolutely. Seek peed a little. You know what? First mention of pee. Yes, I have peed myself. <laughs> Kitty, I think seek peed a lot. Yes, that's right. If anyone who knows me, I don't do things in, in little doses. I peed a lot. I guess we're just gonna keep the suit on? Does that make sense? For any and all new viewers, there's my, ah, oh, Balazar, thank you, dude. There is my social link if anybody wants to check it out. Um, man, so we blew up the station, we got away on the ship, huh? That's dope. Uh, and thank you, Balazar, for the links. There's my Instagram and my YouTube. Uh, my last episode of Seek and Destroy is going to go up on my YouTube page this weekend. And then my Gotham City Bricks Lego stop motion show will begin soon after that. Probably the same day, actually. Um, really? Oh! Shit! jettisoned ourselves. Seek doesn't have to ask anything. <laughs> Bro, I thought it was uh, supposed to get some Gotham City. We were supposed to, uh, Bricks Yesterdoodle. Yeah, dude. Um, I did jump, totally. Uh, like I said, I've been redoing some of the jokes. Trying to make it pun a little pun punch it up a little bit. So yeah, man, I know. I, I was supposed to actually deliver the first episode on Monday. Then I had to rebuild the set. What the fuck? Dedicated the memory of our friend and colleague, Simon Franco, 1978 to 2014. Oh man, rest in peace, dude. What happened? We like flew out into space, that was it. Oh shit, my controller batteries are low. Someone whispered me how this game ends. It's about to, it just ended. And they all lived happily ever after. <laughs> Bull, okay, cunning. I just get back from my grandma's lunch party. She lives in nursing. Oh man, did you guys have fun over there? How's she doing, by the way? How's your grandma doing, Tony? Think you got the ending. I got ending C. Oh, what does that mean? What did I do wrong or right? Uh, good game. Ah, oh, thanks, the bears. Looks like I'm missing a lot of things. Yeah, I'm sorry, dude. I'm missing a lot of things on chat. Well, now I can catch up on chat. Um, she is good. Oh, good. That's good, man. That's good. That's very good. I'm glad she's doing well. Um, so thank you all very much. Have a good night. I will see you all tomorrow. Dead Eye, talk to you tomorrow morning. Yes, either way, Dead Eye in the morning lets you and I talk about the build. So let, don't let me forget that. Uh, just send me a whisper or, um, uh, yeah, send me a whisper and, uh, and we'll talk about it. All right, guys, have a good night. Peace. This open window can lead somewhere or nowhere. It's
it's up to you. What do you mean, who is this? It's Chris. Why won't you believe me?